Ted. How are you doing today? I'm doing good. How are you? Good. I'm Troy. I'm a student physical therapist here at OBG. Okay. So today we're going to examine your balance a little bit. And balance really consists of three different components. You have your vision, you use your eyes for balancing. You also have your inner ear as a vestibular component of balance, as well as your sensory and motor components. So your somatosensory. Your brain saying, basically telling, telling your brain where you are standing in space and in relation to the floor. And then your motor, basically muscle movements and that sort of thing. Um, compensating for any adjustments there. So what we're going to do today is uh, sort of challenge you a little bit and see if there's any areas, any of those three areas that you need to, to maybe work on a little bit. Okay. So first we're going to start with the, um, just, just standing. So I'm going to have you actually put your feet together like this. Put your ankles together good. And then go ahead and take your arms and cross them right there. Perfect. And uh, by the way, this test is called the PASIB, P-E-S-I-B. And uh, like I said, it's measuring balance. All right. So uh, what we're going to do is I'm going to have you stand in that position for 30 seconds. You're ready to go. Looking straight ahead is good. You can pick a target if you'd like. Doing OK. Good, go ahead and relax. So for the second part, well first of all that for that part you had your eyes, so again you're using your eyes and then you're mostly using that sensory mm -hmm. aspect of balance that I was telling you about. So for the next one I'm gonna have you stand in that same position, arms crossed, and this time you're gonna close your eyes. Okay. So you're gonna rely fully on that okay. sensory system. All right. When you're ready, we'll start. Your eyes closed. Okay, next thirty. Open your eyes. Feeling okay? Yeah, that was uh, probably what I thought I was going to do. Oh, wobbly that. So yeah. what that tells me basically is that your your vision is a, a large part of what you use to uh, maintain your balance. Okay. So we'll kind of test that again in a little bit. But All right. First, I'm going to bring out this foam pad here. What we'll use this for to challenge your um, that inner ear that I was telling you about. Mm -hmm. So basically, when you don't have a firm surface to stand on, when the surface is a little um, more unstable, then you're going to use more of that inner ear to sort of tell your tell your brain where, where you're at. So I'll have you step up on this. Good. Feet together just like you were on the floor. Arms across your chest. You go 30 seconds like that. Step down, or you can stay through either way. We're going to relax a little bit. Mm -hmm. And lastly, we're going to do the same thing, but with your eyes closed. Okay. Give it a whirl. Try to get to that 30 second mark if you can. Close your eyes when you're ready. Them close. Let's go. <laughs> Made it to about 10 seconds that time. Wow. Uh, that okay? Was, that was hard. Okay. 
how you feel. Glad you caught me. Dizzy at all, or are you? No, no, I just, I was feeling really off balance. So I sat back and What we're going to do this time, since we didn't quite make it to the 30 second mark, is we're going to try that two more times. Really? And just, we'll, we'll give it a try. We'll see if you're up for it. All right. And then we'll take an average of the score at the end. Shaky, so I think we know what we need to work on. But. <laughs> okay, so one more time. Yes, sir. Catch your breath first. Yeah. And really take it in. Okay. About 11 seconds. Right now. First okay. one was 10, second one was 30, and last one was 11. Legs still coming. Yeah. Well, like I said, we know what we need to work on. So, what I'm going to do is just tally up your score and then talk about what, what it means for your career. Okay. So, here are your results, and you scored a 107. Mm -hmm. So, what it basically did is the 30 seconds that you completed for each task was added to that score over 120. Mm -hmm. And so 120 would be a full score, and since on that last time I had to take the average just because we had the, we fell off the map there for, for a second, um, I had to average that. So it did lower your score a little bit, but your total overall score I'm not really concerned about. Mm -hmm. And you have 107 out of 120, which is you know, pretty solid. Mm -hmm. But um, the areas of concern that I saw with the test was whenever you, whenever your vision was removed. So you're, you're able to handle both the solid stable surface as well as the unstable surface uh, with your eyes open. But as soon as your vision was taken away and your eyes were closed, you struggled to maintain your balance. So you were able to get through it. You know, mm -hmm. even even on the foam surface, you were able to do a complete 30 seconds, which is awesome. Uh, but you did have quite a bit of imbalance there as well. Mm -hmm. So I think what we'll work on as far as treatment is uh, focusing on that, on that, on those situations where your, your balance is distorted or absent. So we'll do things like wearing sunglasses or or um, just closing your eyes, you know, to where your your vision is inhibited. So of course you need to use a little bit of your your other senses as well. Okay. Sounds good? Yeah. All right. Thank you so much. Thank you. Have a good one. Thank you.